Alright guys, hey it's me Chef Mick, cooking for the boys live. This is a mini episode, very quick, on how to put together this graham cracker crust. Now I'm using this one for our Super Bowl, but any time of the year guys, this is something you can do when you need a graham cracker crust for a pudding pie, or in this cake a cheesecake, in this case a cheesecake. <laughs> Alright, first things you need. You need two other things, you need butter and you need graham crackers. Okay, so first we're going to put butter in a little saucepan. We're going to put a little bit of butter and we're going to, we're, all we're going to do is melt it down. So make sure your heat is not too high, guys. Make sure your heat is not too high. Again, I don't really use butter. I use a Smart Balance butter spread. It has butter taste, but it's better for my heart. And if you see everything else I cook, you know I need something good for my heart eventually. All right, so you see we're going to melt it down slowly. I'll even turn this down a little bit more. Now, the next thing is we have graham crackers. These happen to be honey graham cracker crackers. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> you can also use cinnamon graham crackers or chocolate graham crackers, any flavor that you happen to like. Okay? So make sure you get the flavor that you like that's going to go best with whatever you're making. All right. Now, we're going to take these, just take a few of them. I'm not, I'm not making a big one today. You know what? I'm just going to take uh, one, two, three, four, five, five. Okay? I'm going to break them up, but this happens to be my food processor. I'm not going to just stick them in like this. I'm going to actually break them up a little bit for my food processor. And then let the food processor do the rest of the work. So watch out for the noise. couple of good pulses like that, and guess what, and then voila, or voila, or however you like to say it, look at that, beautiful, beautiful, graham cracker, uh, graham cracker crumbs, and then look at the butter melted, we're taking off the heat, we pour it into the crumbs, and you're gonna say, wow, that may not be enough butter, and you may just be right. So let me heat up a little bit more butter. I'd rather do that. And let me heat that up. Yes, yeah, somebody was calling me. I'm very popular. Yay, me. And then we do this. While I melt some more butter, I'm just gonna mix these together. Frankly, this thing isn't gonna help, so mix them together with your hands. And that is all there is to it. Okay? I am going to need, as you can see, I will be needing some more but liquid, some more butter in this case. That should be good for me. And this other butter will melt in here as I'm working with it. So, that should work. Alright guys. And then, you can, if you want, you can cook it a little longer. Like if you want to pre-bake it, but you don't have to. There's nothing here that's raw. There's nothing here that needs to be cooked through before any of your other ingredients. All right, and then we find ourselves a pan. We uh, fill the bottom of the pan. Let me get a pan. Don't go anywhere. Look, this is my cute little pan for the day. We fill the bottom of the pan, and we push it down together so it stays together. And, ladies and gentlemen, you have a graham cracker crust for your pies. All right, I'm Chef Mick, cooking for the boys live. And peace and love, guys. Peace and love. Bye.